Hello, I'm Andy from the IT Help Desk. In this video, we'll go over how to activate your ETAD account and access your login credentials. So, if you're a new student here at the University of Toledo or a new faculty or staff member, first off, congrats and welcome to UToledo. We're going to begin the two-step process of activating your ETAD account. Now to start, go to myutaccount.utoledo.edu. Now once you're there, you should see a student with a yellow shirt in front of Libby Hall, like so. Once you're there, go ahead and click on the third box here that says new account creation and activation. And then for this activation to work, you will need your rocket ID that you were given either in your acceptance letter to the university or from HR if you're a faculty or staff member. Now, if for some reason you have not received a rocket ID, please reach out to your respective admissions office or contact your HR representative. So I will go ahead and activate my account here. And then you also want to enter your date of birth here in the form of MMDDYYYY. Like so. And then you'll just go ahead and click on find account. All right. So then you'll be pr prompted to accept the responsible use policies and other related policies. Now, once you have read all of these over, go ahead and click on the check mark down below. And then go ahead and click on submit to then proceed to the next step. All right. And then you'll go ahead and create a new password for your account. Now, the password does have some requirements that must be followed. Otherwise, you risk not being able to log into your account. The main requirements to create a strong password are as follows. It must be between 8 to 15 characters. It must contain at least one capital letter, lowercase letter, number, and a special character such as an exclamation point or parentheses, for example. It also cannot have any part of your name inside of it. Now, you'll know you have a secure enough password when you satisfy all of these checks located here on the site. These will dynamically update as you are entering your password. So I'll go ahead and enter my password here. Like so. And you'll see as I'm entering my password, I got a bunch of green check marks here that tell me my password is secure. And I'll just go ahead and click set password here. All right. So then after your account has started activating, you will then see this confirmation message that reads, your account is being built and Office 365 resources are being assigned. It may take up to 30 minutes for this process to complete and you can log in to configure your multi-factor authentication or MFA options. So then you'll also see below your UTED username in bold and also in red letters here. Um, so the term UTED is what Utilito calls your username. So if anyone like a professor or a fellow coworker asks you for your UTED, it's what you see in the red text here. Now, once you have that, make sure you have your UTED credentials saved somewhere like a password manager on your phone or web browser. Now, the last step in setting up your UTED account is to register for password reset and set up multi-factor authentication, as it says right here in step two. Now, to set up MFA, please follow along with a second video that can be found back on the MyUT account page. Again, your account is still coming online, so if you are unable to log in and set up MFA, just wait until after the time you see in the red text right here, then try to log in again. Now, if you have any further questions or issues, feel free to submit a new ticket at ithelp.utilita.edu or call the IT Help Desk at 419-530-2400 for further assistance.